Six months ago, I defended myself against the demon that took away my parents. When I went to school, I thought my friends would believe me but, when I told them what happened, they just laughed at me and said I was some crazy killer. It got so bad that I had to drop out of school. I got myself a new home. All alone. And I just wish my Nana would call me her little gem again. Just one more time. Hum, I should probably go to the kitchen and wash my hands. There, that should keep my hands clean. Huh? What was that? Hello? Is someone there? I better go check what it is. <laughs> huh what the where am i what is this place i think i just saw mr hop and it all suddenly turned to black but it seems like he's not done with me yet i'll have to find another way to defeat this creature can't this nightmare be over already? Huh? Who's this? Another girl that's about the same age as me? I should probably free her. Oh, thank you I... Wait, Ruby, how do you know me? Who are you? Ruby it's me, I'm... Come on, I'll explain everything later. Mr. Hop is coming, we got to run. Well done Ruby, you really are my little gem. Nana, I can't believe it. It's so good to see you again dear. So Ruby, how did you get here? It's that scary white rabbit Mr. Hop. He took me down here. Nana, is there any way we can defeat this nightmare for good? Oh no, this is my fault. Don't worry dear, I've experienced this. The fallen guardian of hope. The entity. Wait, then that means, we're in the underworld? Yes dear, this is the underworld. But, this is where all the bad people go though. We're not bad right? Of course not. This is different in this case. Remember the necklace I used to own? The medallions? The ones you said that protected us? Yes dear, I use it to keep the entity and Mr. Hop away from us. But as I grew older and weaker, I couldn't do that anymore. We must get those medallions. It's the only way to end this nightmare for both of us. Ruby, oh no, we got separated, I have to find her, but I must find those medallions as well, I'll go search around to see where they are. Esther, look, your first medallion is in here. Huh, who said that? Oh, there we go, the first medallion. Huh, wait, what's going on with the medallion? Who are you? What do you want with me? I want nothing with you. But you are the key to my next victim of souls. Your daughter Esther. She'll be in grave danger. So be aware. What? Why my daughter? She's still not born yet. How do you know about us? You leave my child alone right now. Oh we'll see about that. Mwahahaha. -ha -ha -ha. Him. It must be a memory of my mom. I think some of them have memories in them. I should probably keep searching. Aha. Uh -huh. There's the second one. Arthur, I spoke with those above. I felt the presence of the divine. They say our child is special, and in grave danger. Faith, you are not well. Please, come home. We want you to feel better. Perfect. Another memory. Two down. Only four medallions to go.
Okay, here goes the third one. Forgive me, my daughter and husband. This is for to save my family from danger. That's another memory down, only three left to go. There's the fourth one, perfect. Please. I beg of you, can please take care of our lovely daughter at your orphanage home? Sure, we can take her in with her new orphanage friends. Thanks for the drop off sir. Yes, I got four medallions so far. That should be the last memory inside these things. Just got two more to go. I bet the entity and his friends has them. Hold on Ruby, I'm coming. What the? Where am I? Where's my Nana? Well, well, well. Hello, Ruby. Please don't hurt me. Fear not, young girl. I came to help you. As you can see, we are cursed, forsaken, and not evil. We must carry unfortunate souls to the other side. The six will make suffering more bearable. They belong to me. And Esther is nothing but a foolish thief. She could hurt you too. What? That's not true. You're lying. Oh, really? If she really cared for you, why would she give you a rabbit toy that taken everything from you? Your parents, your friends not believing, you're trapped here in the underworld. But, she... You see? She never cared about you if you had everything taken away from you because of her. She's lied to you, and that's why she's using to steal what's rightfully mine. Help me find her and you will be rewarded and give you everything. Alright. As soon as I enter this room, I'm close to finding the entity. I just got to deal with the trio. Maybe after I defeat them, I can get those two last medallions from them. Alright here goes nothing. Ugh. You all have failed me. I'll destroy her myself. I got the fifth medallion. Hang on Ruby, I'm coming. Mwahahaha. <laughs> Cut it with the laugh entity. Where is she? She's right here. Safe and sound. Ruby, are you okay? Young Ruby has come to her senses. She no longer wants to do anything with you. You gave me that toy, Nana. You took my life away from me. You're the reason that I'm even here. Ruby, I really never wanted to give you that toy. They took control of me and forced me to do it. I'm so sorry I couldn't protect you. Another lie. You're still my little gem, right? Enough of this. You will die here, Esther. No. I won't let you, Nana, take the sixth medallion. What? No, you treacherous wretch. Ruby, no, oh no oh no, Ruby. Pathetic. Your compassion around the others you love, it makes you so weak. You both will die here.
And now, it is you who will experience fear. Prepare for the ultimate nightmare of your life entity. No, 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 no. Thank you, Nana. Wow, you look amazing. Oh, and I'm sorry that I didn't trust you. That's okay, I think your mom and dad are waiting for you up there. What? You're not coming? With the entity defeated, the underworld needs a new ruler. And besides, there's no need for a girl like me up in the real world. Someone's got to keep these souls in check down here. Goodbye Nana. I am so proud of you Esther.